guys welcome to my channel again uh, I know it's been a long time over a, a month because even though I've been doing videos every month last video was like at the beginning of the month of last month and then this month is at the end of the month I'm sorry about that I've been working on getting more stuff for you guys but I've been also brainstorming on what I'm gonna do here because I have the other channels you know and that one is doing great but I wanted to do something special on this channel and I think I got it so we're gonna talk about that at the end after we see what I have here and um, what I have here I just got it I just opened it I wasn't expecting to get it right now but uh, it, it just came really quick and it's so cute. I needed to make this video right now. So I kind of looked through it. I opened it, but I didn't um, didn't actually look through it too much. So I'm going to do it. This is kind of like a first look with you guys. So I got the Portable Painter Micro. And I'm so excited about it. I have the bigger one right here and I love it I use it every single day for my commission work and I saw this one even though I don't need it I thought it was so cute I needed to get it so it came with all of these in the package I don't see anything else included it has a thank you note from them and I got it from uh, I believe it was Indiegogo and I'll leave the link below there kind of hard to find right now they're not on Amazon they're not on eBay not uh, not here in the United States or when I look a week ago so I went straight to their website I was able to buy it there for around $20 and uh, that was a week ago it came really fast I wasn't expecting to get this for a month or so so I'm happy about that and it came in this little bag and it's kind of like a soft, kind of suede feeling. And here it is. It's so tiny. Look at it. Oh, it's so cute. Here you can see it's 3 times 2 inches. And then the thickness is about an inch. And then it came with kind of like the instructions on how to, to assemble it. And then it shows the old one. What else is in here? Here's how you assemble it and stuff. And yeah, some more information. And it also came with these little uh, things. I haven't looked inside if they have some of them. But here it looks like it has bigger ones as well. So if you wanted to get like the full pants instead of the half pants, you could fit three or mix, mix and match, I guess. Let's see what comes in here. So, okay, okay, so you take the top, then you pull out kind of the middle, and then you will assemble it kind of like you do the bigger one, one on each side. For what I understand, you put the water here, and then you get this little thing for your hand. When you're painting, this will be great for it to take it into a cafe. Uh, well, not right now because we're in quarantine. But I don't know. Like even if you want to paint in your bed and you don't want something big, this will be great. Or me, I I tend to do my practice drawings every night while I'm making dinner. So I think I'm going to bring this one out. Now, as you can see, I only have six spaces here. And I work with a 12, 12 color palette. But I think this will be ideal to get with one of those warm colors and uh, cold color sets for the primary. And I have here the Daniel Smith, which I I use those on my uh, everyday palette plus uh, my convenience colors. So it will be great to get these two things in combination so you can have all your primaries and be able to make all kinds of colors and uh, you only need this but there is uh, and it looks like it has these are extra so it has the ones that it comes with and then it has the extra ones so what I was saying is that you can mix, mix and match and then you have the the larger one and you can fit it so if you wanna if you don't want to use uh, 
the six primary you can use four you know whatever you feel like three colors three primaries if if you have a a simple kind of um style now i got mine because i have these other colors that i want to get now the one that it came with uh this one was the one that came when I ordered. It doesn't fit. It looks like it's too small to kind of snug in there. But um, but I don't think it's a big deal. I can make it work. There you go. And then um, that's why I got this one. Because I wanted to keep the, the other colors that are kind of extra. That are more like I want those pearlescent colors. More like a one. Less like a neat. <laughs> So let's try this with water and see how that's going to go. Okay, I got my water here. I, I stole the water from my plant. Oh, I might have put too much. Well, maybe not. And then the idea is to pull out that, that part in the bottom and then hold it in between. Oh, I spill here. So maybe you want less water. Just a little bit of water and with your brush. So the idea is to kind of just, you see, just kind of go like this and clean your brush. And just paint like, you see, like this will be the perfect setup to be in a cafe. You know, cafes have little tables, so you don't have a big space to put one of these, even though this one's small. It kind of takes a lot of your table, but if you're in a cafe and and you pull it out of your purse or your pocket, and then you have all you need here, your water, your mixing here. Let me grab from the other one. You see, and then it's pretty practical. Now, this, I don't know if I will use full time because I feel like if you're doing this full time, you're working as an illustrator full time, you're gonna need uh, convenience colors because it helps you go faster. So that's why I have, instead of a six color, I have a 12 colors because I have my convenience colors to move faster in my commission. But this will be great for uh, people that just want, want it for hobbies, uh, urban sketchers that just like to, you know, be in the bus and do a quick sketch and pull it out. I think this will be great for hobbies, for that kind of people that just like to have something when they're out and about, bored, and they just want to make a quick painting, this will be great for them. Full time, I don't think so. I think um, you will need more colors. Uh, also, you will need more water because you're painting for eight hours or more a day, so you're going to need more space. But I'm satisfied with this. I'm happy for what I bought it for, which is to keep the pearlescent colors. So I'm going to use these two in combination. So that works for me. Uh, and also, I like it because I think I'm going to put it in my purse. It's small enough. I can carry it everywhere. I can just dump the water really quick. And then put it all back together. So to put it back together, you just slice, slide the sides. Close it. Oh, it's so cute. And then you put it in here. Um, then you close the whole thing. Wait, which way it goes? This way. There you go. And look at it. It's just so tiny. It perfectly fits in my purse. And then I can carry it everywhere. And I'll keep this in my house. And if I decide to get other colors, or if I dis or if I get a color that is that I want to keep bigger then I'll use this but it came with this for the same price so I was really happy because I can have an option for what I understand uh, the spaces are not standard so you're gonna have some variation between brands some pants are gonna be too loose some pants are gonna be too tight so it's better to get tubes and then fill up the ones that it came with instead of buying them in the pan um, the only downside I see of that, if, if if you like to keep your 
your color is really full you know some people prefer the pants in my case i prefer to buy the tubes so i can kind of clean it as i go too because i only put a little bit and when i run out of that i clean it and then i feel my color all clean again but it's just a preference but definitely i recommend this little cute thing this will be amazing for gifts as well you know the holidays are coming i mean i know it's only the seventh month but trust me the colleagues are gonna be coming and you're gonna try to find something for your best friend that loves painting or your family member that loves painting and this will be amazing for them the, they're gonna be really happy if they're watercolor is and it's something so cute i mean that's uh, i think i just got it because it was cute but i like it i'm gonna use it and i hope you guys like it now with that being said Let's go back to the channel. So I've been working on brainstorming of the, the direction I want to take this channel to. So you guys know I've been working on coloring books and the coloring books are um, a big part of, of what I'm, my work day nowadays. So I wanted to do something related with that. So I thought, it would be a great idea to start doing originals out of my line work. So I'm going to be posting some time lapse of my original line work, but do it in watercolor because obviously this channel is uh, focused on watercolor. So here are some of the things, uh, the line work I've been thinking i'm gonna make in watercolor so they're kind of uh signatures and i hope you guys are excited about this because i'm really excited to do these in watercolors and let you guys um see the process of how i will do uh these kind of paintings on watercolor plus we haven't we do a lot of kind of realistic here things here and not so much fantasy and to be honest I love making fantasy and I don't get to do as much of it because of the commission work most of it is just re real people you know in their weddings their, their family portraits and stuff and I wanted to do something more original so I thought this would be a great opportunity for you guys to see that side of me that you guys haven't seen and I'm really excited about it I feel confident that you guys are gonna like it so if you like the idea leave some comments below and if you like this review don't forget to give it a like because I'm gonna be re still reviewing some other products and check out my channel as well if you are new here I have plenty of watercolor reviews and things like that. Okay, guys, don't forget to like it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for those paintings coming up. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.